it's me, Yowie yeah, Piglet. Of course. Um, I wanted to make a rant video, but not about one, a lot of subjects, but about one subject only. The Darren Shan movie. Hopefully this will get a lot of views, and a lot of people might agree with me. Um, well, let's start with the books and the author. Um, Darren Shan is a very, very famous author um, whose real name, I believe, is Darren O'Shanzi, or how do you pronounce it? And he created the novels, um, The Saga of Darren Shan, The Demonata, and The Saga of Larkin Cressley. And a couple of other books I haven't read yet. Um, I guess a certain director, I can't remember the name, decided that he wanted to make a Darren Chan movie. The trailer was fantastic and everything, but the movie, how do I put this? Sucked! How can they be so stupid? Can you believe the damn idiot odyssey in that movie? Okay, first of all, I'm a huge fan of Darren Chan, and I know the rules. Darren is not 16 years old. He doesn't have super perfect parents. I want every little tiny detail perfect. They don't mind that Darren and Steve are best friends. Darren's like 13 or 6, 12 in the book. Okay, the things that were wrong in, in the movie, I will list off. Darren was 16. His parents were perfectionists. Oh, that was the word I was looking for. Um, Mr. Krepsley is dating Triska. Gabner is some fancy schmancy pants. Um, uh, um, what was her name? Um, Tuska, I believe her name. Tuska, you know, the girl with... The woman with the really tough teeth and everything, she's not some self, she doesn't have self-issue things. She doesn't have self-esteem issues. Ebra is not some teenager who wants to be a rock and roll star. And I'm sorry if I'm yelling. Um, um, let me see what else was there. Oh, yeah. Um, oh, what was his name? Mar Marlock. Marlock! Marlock is not Steve's mentor. And Mr. Tiny doesn't reveal any big secrets. He doesn't even meet Darren until book two. Darren can't flint. He doesn't have a girlfriend who has a monkey tail. And everything was just so wrong about this film. Okay, let's start with the books. The book started out in the bathroom. The movie started out in the cemetery. Steve and Darren skip class. Darren and Steve go outside in the book to play football, and their friend and their friend Tommy or Alan brings a piece of paper that could change their destinies forever, which it does. In the movie, Mr. Tiny drives by in his freaking car and drops it in front of Darren and Steve to see. There was no Tommy. There was no Alan. It was a nightmare. They sneak out to see the, the show. One of the little people is handing out the tickets. We don't see the little people until book two. I will continue. <clears throat> Steve doesn't get bitten in the book. At least not by a, a little person. Then there's the show. Triska has buck teeth. That's fine. Rhonda's two bellies is nicer. He's sweeter. Alexander Ribs was okay. But Carmack Lamb isn't seen until book two, not book one. And he doesn't even show up 
in the show until like book two. And in the movie, they made him a her. And gave him the red guy. Hello? That is so stupid. Ugh. There were hundreds of good things and bad things about this film. Mr. Krebs, was never part of some gang called the Mofreakins. That's not true. He was part of a gang called the Club. I mean, the Cubs. Please see the saga of Darren, uh, sorry, Darren Krebsley. Darren steals the spider, yes, but he doesn't get saved by Mr. Tiny. Everything was wrong in this movie. It was stupid. It was horrible. I think that John C. Riley did a really good job playing Mr. Krebsley, but... But, and Steve, and Steve's actor, he portrayed his evilness, but Darren is not some dork in a pair of jeans. Darren's girlfriend is name, girlfriend's name is Debbie, and we see her in book three. This movie sucked. It was horrible. There was so many things wrong with this film. I think the director should have been shot. And you know what? There was... You know what? I would actually I'm going to make a quick video after this video and I'm gonna pick actors who I think should have played in the movie. I'm gonna look through kid actors, I'm gonna look through grown up actors, and I'm gonna pick the music. I'm gonna pick scary, creepy music. And you know what? I know the Darren Shan books. If they wanted to make a vampire trilogy, it has to be on the book. It has to be correct. And it's got to be gory. I want gory. Not some teenage angst. It was worse than Twilight. And that's saying something. And any Twilight fans are watching this? Don't you rant on my video. I mean it. My video? Darren Shan. Twilight fans? Get the hell out of here. Anyway, my point is that the movie sucks. The whole thing was damn pathetic. <sighs> if anybody agrees with me, please, I implore you, comment, and I will agree with you. But if I get any fights on my video and any swearing, I will dis I will discontinue. I will I will turn off the what you call them? the comments. Okay? I mean it. I don't want any. C words, B words, R words. I don't want to, you know, if you're going to say bitch or bastard or anything like that, I mean, or shit, comment about the movie or the actors. Okay? That's what I want. I want you to complain about the movie. Just the movie on this video. But if I see any C words, I will be extremely cross and I will delete you. Or I will block you or anything. So, I am ranting about the Darren Chan film and how bad it sucked. Oh, and by the way, at the end, Darren sleeps in a coffin. He doesn't sleep at all in a coffin! A and entirely, in the whole movie, the, I mean in the books, the only time he sleeps in a coffin is when they arrive at Vampire Mountain. So please, rant about the movie on this video and I will agree with you. That's all I want, okay? Okay, I am going to turn off this video. I am going to look up actors, and I'm going to put them, put it on YouTube, and I want you guys to comment on which actors you agree with and which ones you don't. Okay? So, this is Yowie Piglet ranting about the dumbest movie they've ever made, besides Twilight. And I hope to see you guys again soon. Bye-bye! Oh, and uh, one more thing. What was the other thing I was going to look up? Oh, yeah. And uh, one more thing. If you're a Darren Shen fan, do you agree with me? Uh, give me um, the name of the director so I can, so I can complain about him. So, bye!